there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Pastiche of Skin. We're here to do another cold open slash PS freebies. This is another game that was available on the PlayStation Plus, but not in Europe, not in New York, not in New York, <laughs> North America, but in Hong Kong. Now, Curses and Chaos is the unique game for PS Plus this month on Hong Kong. Which is kind of, it's almost become like a standard now, where there's at least one game that's not being done on either in North America or EU. Even this month, North America and EU had a difference between their releases, and I still managed to get the game that wasn't in the EU release of PS Plus this month, because it's on the Hong Kong account. I cannot recommend the service, the PS Plus on Hong Kong, enough. It, I mean, occasionally, you get Chinese games that are in Chinese. Now, that's going to happen because you're buying games from Hong Kong and you're getting free ones just offered to you. But on the other side of it is there's a lot of English games that are released over there as well or games that have dual language. This is one of them. This is in English. And uh, I have literally no idea what the hell Curses and Chaos is about. It looks like, um, a, like a platforming slash kind of like a monster crawler. It reminds me a lot of Ghosts and Goblins, but I think it's multiplayer. But we'll take a look in and see what it actually is. But uh, yeah, guys, get on to Hong Kong PlayStation Plus or Malaysia or something. Like, get, get yourselves onto a secondary account just for the free games that are available. I like the artwork in this game already. Well, not even the game, but the actual like artwork on the marketing for it. Chaos, the kingdom is but a playground for the Wizard King's cursed rule. No one is safe. The king's monstrous creatures spread across the land. Can they be stopped? Leah, soul wielder of the ancient mock punch technique. The mighty mountain without a past. Leo, a mysterious tandem daring to fight back against the horde. Who are they? You dare rise against me? You shall find yourself under the stride of death itself. First, Leo and Leah are swarmed by monsters. Stalked by death itself wherever they go. Only Allison, a rogue alchemist, offers help. And a solution. The elixir of life. It can lift any curse. The guild says it doesn't exist. But I know how to make it. There's only one way. To get all the ingredients. Fight monsters. It sounds so like the Ghost and Goblins theme tune as well. I am on board with this. Okay, so what we got? Uh, equip? Hmm. Owly! <laughs> They're all unknown items. We haven't got anything equipped yet. Um, talk to her? Take a break. You'll always be safe here in the caravan. Cursed though you may be, the path of your redemption lies through the mouth of chaos. Fight back. Okay. Oh, wow. The game is really just, like, super simple. So, uh, Leah or Leo... Um, oh, there's all the multiplayer in there too. <laughs> uh, I'm looking forward to giving this a wee two player. Um, yeah, Will, you need to drag your ass up here to play this sometime because it's going to be good fun. All right, jumping into the forest. What we got? Boom. Boom. Oh, nice. Ah, oh, you only have the weapon for one turn. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
I'm liking this. It's such a simple game. It's just wave after wave. It's just standing in one spot, just punching the life out of things. Can't beat it. Imagine it's pretty much a, um, not a roguelike, but it's one of those things where you keep your money between rounds and you can use that to upgrade yourself and have better equipment for the next time you're, um, fighting. Boom. Ah, oh, the music's pretty badass too. Nice! Ah! No! Rounded health! Woo! That was close. Only two seconds left. <laughs> Do you have a time limit to get rid of them as well? Oh no, I died! Ah! She knocks you out of there. This kind of sucks. Oh, nice! Die! Ah! No! No! Don't die! Alright, got it. <laughs> Nine seconds left. I really need to heal myself. Ah! Ah, damn it. Yeah. Hello, zombie boy. Fuck you. Ow. So if you hit the ground, you actually get hurt. Damn, I'm good. I'm actually enjoying the hell out of this. It's actually one of those things where I don't want to lose, I don't want to die, but I'll make it to the end, I'm pretty sure. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ow, dead. Nice! If I punch up, it does more damage. Oh, crap. I did not mean to do that. Ah! Three, four, five... Ah! There we go. So I imagine essentially as long as I make it to the end of the time, I don't actually die, I think, but I lose time by the fact that I need to actually recover. Nice. Oh, I thought that was going to be the big uh, air drop one that was actually the same the last time. It must be the difference whenever I drop it in midair or whether I drop it on the floor. Missed twice.
Boom! <laughs> Ah, I died! That was my last one. Ah, well. Okay. So it was that I made it to wave some for another, and then go in the shop and you can buy and sell. So you actually have, oh, meat, clovers, shurikens. Right, so you can just, oh, so you actually get anything that you've uh, noticed or matched and seen. Okay, I got you now. Yeah. And then once you mix any of the ingredients, that makes sense. Right, so that's how you actually have to get one of everything in the games. So you have to play through far enough to get a random drop of the items to actually build them up together. Um, to actually complete the game, to actually be able to get the elixir. But um, I'm assuming there's a whole thing about mixing two items together and makes another item. And then you have a chain of those one after another until you actually get to the point where you get to the end of the game. That's, that's a cool idea. I actually like that. Oh uh, yeah, and better chains do better drops. Right, so you have to actually like avoid getting hit. Cool. I can get behind that. That's awesome. So curses and chaos, guys. That's actually been a that's been a, a simple and fun little game. Tribute Games, you rocked it. Um, the I'm pretty sure this is available on all the other stores as well. It's not just in Hong Kong, but if you want it for free, you can get it through the Hong Kong PlayStation Plus. I'm enjoying the hell out of it. I'm looking forward to playing a little bit of two-player with it. Uh, it seems very simple. It seems to be like a very quick pick-up-and-play uh, combat -y game where you're probably not going to get in each other's way. And I imagine they've got, even though it looks so simple, I'm pretty sure there actually is some kind of like team-up move that you can do together. It's like these kind of games always have that little bit hidden in, a little bit extra if you want to go to the bother of playing a multiplayer. And I imagine it'll be a, a lot easier slash harder. Especially if you hit each other as well. That'd be weird. But um, yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. This has been me playing Curses and Chaos for a episode of PS Freebies. Uh, get yourselves onto the Hong Kong PSN uh, uh, and get yourself a PS Plus. Such an easy thing to do. Such a cheap choice. I recommend it wholeheartedly. And uh, I'll continue to keep on showing you these games if you guys don't even try to try get them yourselves. If you enjoyed watching me playing Curses and Chaos and you liked my commentary over the game and actually enjoyed watching this channel, then make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you hit the subscribe button, you'll be able to see these videos on a regular basis. You'll actually see them coming out every single time that they come out. You get a notification. And if you actually want to see more stuff from me specifically, you can actually just search for this name here. Past Teacher Skin. Just Google it. Uh, if you type that in, you'll find me on many, many of the sources. So, yeah, you can just see whatever I do. There's some of the platforms I work chat on and do stuff on are all listed here if you actually jump on to two or three of those i'd be a very very appreciative and if you actually look over here on the site if you're on youtube there'll be three boxes one box will be other ps freebie videos over there in the far right will be one that i'll choose for you guys and down here is one specifically for you the viewer it's based off of youtube analytics and google stuff and it actually picks a video for you to be in that box it is the one that it recommends that you watch next over this channel so um, i hope you go and check it out and i hope to see you dudes all in the next video. Bye.